Okay, hi people. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Red Sun Gamer. Uh, this is a quick tutorial of how to connect your PlayStation 4 to your PlayStation Vita. So first off, make sure that your Vita is on firmware 3.00. So system, system information, 3.00. Okay? So... Once you've established that, uh, what you need to do is on your PlayStation 4, go to settings, scroll down to uh, uh, PS Vita connection settings, click on that, and then make sure these two boxes are clicked, is enable remote play and connect direct with PS Vita, and click on add device. So you click on add device and it will give you an eight digit code. On your PlayStation, uh, in firmware 3.00, uh, you have this thing here, place PS4 link. So click on that. Start the application. Okay. So now, click on the first option. And now it will ask you to input this 8-digit PIN number, okay? So, so 2917- one two zero three and connect and then it says register so click on register okay so now it's registering okay so now I should have control of my PlayStation 4 with the Vita okay there you go connected Okay, so I should be able to. There you go. Yep. Okay, so now I, I, I have control, as you can see. Okay. So, I want to play some. Uh, let's say I want to play multiplayer uh, Lego Marvels with my daughter. Okay. And I don't have a second controller, which I don't. I only have a PS4. Four controller and I have a Vita no problem I don't need a second controller I can use my Vita so now that this is remote play I can I think I can skip this nope come on okay there you go skip Okay, start the demo. I think I have to sit through this unskippable cutscene, which is uh, really stupid. But anyway, enjoy it. All right, I let these bigwigs go. What you bring me some of those cosmic bricks? Why didn't they make me the supervisor here? That guy's got sand for brains. Holding Grand Central hostage at rush hour? Now that's criminal. Hulk, you have to remember to look before you leap. I know, bad guys. The S.H.I.E.L.D. folks think we need to formulate a careful plan using... Or we just smash our way in. Good plan. Welcome back to New York, gentlemen. Okay, so... Look at this mess. As you can see. Didn't we just clean up this city? Okay. Player 1 is on the Vita. And there's Maybe no light some heavy on the PlayStation 4 controller, which means this is not connected or is not signed into an account. So, I want to sign it in. Hulk, remember, so, you can transform press the PlayStation button. Down. 
and the light will start and it'll ask you to log into an account. So I'm going to log into my second account, which is this one. Okay, so now, PlayStation, I'm now logged in and I'm going to. There you go, I'm the second player and on my Vita, I'm the Hulk. Okay, so now two player co op. Pretty smart. And it works really well. Uh, I finished Knack uh, a few days ago with my daughter, and she used the Vita as the a second controller. We actually took turns a piece, actually, and uh, it worked perfectly well. Um, we had a good time, and it was a great way to play. So if you don't have a second controller, and you do have a Vita, it's the way to do it, okay? Just remember, though, you need two accounts. Once you have two accounts, no problem, okay? Just log in to... Uh, just log into the second account with the with the controller and you're good to go okay so anyways thanks for watching uh, I'll put up another video soon thanks bye